What am I most proud of? I would think one of the overriding things is there's a lot of aero road bikes out there that move their brakes to the chainstay. It's a great place to mount a brake from a stiffness standpoint, but from a service standpoint, it's really challenging. Not only during the setup, you have to maneuver around the, cr the crank set. In a race situation, it's almost impossible for a mechanic to hang out of the car and try to adjust the brake you know, on the fly. The rider would have to stop. So there's some disadvantages to having a, a brake mounted on the chainstay. And we realized that in the design process and we wanted to keep it up on the seat stay. All of our product designs, we want to integrate mechanic feedback, both, you know, whether it be a shop or the team mechanic from, you know, one of our pro teams. We want the products to be user friendly, easy to service. And yeah, that's an overriding goal. Very similar situation to like on the Norcom Straight where we put a vertical dropout for easier wheel changes to make it easier, not only for mechanics, but also users to change to their race wheels. Being able to see the brake is always a good thing before and during a race. And we're really happy that Fuji decided to go that direction, yeah. During a race situation, wheel changes, it makes that whole process a lot less stressful. If someone, for instance, say like the neutral support changes the wheel, they'll be able to, to work on it or open the brake more easily. Um, and just being able to, to confirm that it, the wheel isn't rubbing within the frame after a wheel change is a huge plus also. If you look at a traditional dual pivot brake, there's a plate on the back that the, the two pivots are in, and that plate has a central mounting bolt. Direct mount removes that redundant material and mount directly to the frame. That does two things. It makes the mounting area stiffer, and it moves the brake closer to the frame so you can model the frame around the brake to make it more aerodynamic.